Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make this uh, teleportation effect using only one texture. First of all, we need to create this texture. Done. Also, we need to create one model in Blender. Just add mesh, torus, then go to uh, settings, set minor radius to 0, 0, 001, uh, segments to 3, and uh, press export. Export SVBX with uh, these settings. Uh, apply if you use Unity, uh, face, uh, disable if bones, and name it. Import this texture and model into Unity, then create a new uh, shader, shader graph, uh, uh, your rendering pipeline, and uh, unlit shader. Then open this shader, open uh, shader settings, set uh, surface tra tra transparent, blending type uh, left it alpha, uh, render face boss. Uh, you can enable alpha clipping and set this value to 001, but it is better without it. Also, just uh, uh, enable in in some case uh, if you need support with fixed graph. Uh, after that, add a new property. This property will, will be uh, texture. Uh, enable tiling and offset for this texture. Add uh, another property. Name it. Uh, name it. Emission. Uh, set it value to 10 just uh, for now uh, then uh, then add uh, this texture property add this uh, float value add the uh, sample texture and uh, multiply it with uh, uh, emission and also multiply it with vertex color we need vertex color to change color in the particle system. Multiply, multiply, and add this to base color. Also, uh, split uh, uh, vertex color to get alpha value and multiply this value with uh, texture uh, alpha value and add this to alpha channel. Uh, that's all. That's uh, the shader we need. We need the shader because if you create a standard material, um, where is it? Material, universal render pipeline, particles, unlit. Uh, we can control uh, the emission for base uh, texture. So we need to create uh, own shader and create a new material using this shader oh my god glow and uh, select your texture that's uh, the only material we need for now we can start work with particle system just create a new one set position then select uh, materials that you created uh, also uh, go to shape and uh, rotate it minus 19 degrees set uh, radius to 0. Point, uh, uh, six angle to zero set uh, your color and also set uh, size between uh, uh, maybe zero zero one and zero point one after that uh, change duration to one set lifetime to maybe zero point three and zero point seven uh, speed from two and uh, twelve set uh, limit velocity over a lifetime maybe value 0 0.2 also said uh, curve for speed uh, value and uh, and uh, disable rate over uh, time and uh, add boost uh, after that uh, go um, uh, also I think it's better to change uh, 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 to click allow material o override and uh, save because uh, I think it's better to use uh, uh, additive 
blending mode for these uh, for these sparks. Uh, also, uh, go to render mode and set to stretched billboard. Uh, set lens to maybe 10 and uh, speed scale to 0.1. Also, go to size over lifetime and uh, set from big size to small size this screw. Uh, also, you can uh, mm, I think it's better to change uh, the color or maybe disable uh, apply a active color space uh, to make uh, the same color for different renders. Uh, also, you can copy this uh, uh, this particle system, uh, then select uh, render mode to mesh, select your uh, torus, uh, change render alignment to local, uh, after that uh, change shape radius to zero, but uh, enable uh, emit from volume and set volume to uh, maybe lens 2 and move it minus uh, 1 position. This, uh, make also the same for teleport. Move it minus 1 and set volume uh, with lens 1. Uh, after that, uh, oh, zero radius. Uh, after that, uh, change uh, size for. Uh, for torus from 1 to 0 0.1 uh, and uh, go to texture sheet animation set tiles 3 uh, and 3 uh, set frame over time constant and set value value 4 uh, to uh, so we only use this middle part for torus uh, and uh, uh, set size over lifetime the opposite uh, curve. Also set uh, color over lifetime uh, to make it uh, disappear. Also go to emission and set maybe um, 15 sparks and disable speed and uh, set a lifetime maybe from 3 to 5 or maybe even 2 and three uh, or or even smaller scale maybe 10 articles only okay after that you can copy the main component and uh, select uh, shape uh, with radius 0 uh, then uh, uh, set position also to 0 uh, make this size really big but set first set emission to 1 and size maybe also 1 uh, disable uh, speed or just make it uh, very low uh, just for appearance and uh, uh, disable size over lifetime, but enable freedom stretching and set lens scale to uh, to 1.5 and uh, speed scale to zero. Now we have this glow, but also disable volume, make it uh, appear from base. Also, maybe the size too will be better. Uh, after that, uh, or after maybe length 6 and size 1 yeah i think that's better uh, and uh, after that copy this com uh, component again uh, go to render mode set it to billboard set size to uh, to 2 uh, disable speed set uh, lifetime to maybe this 3.3 uh, the same from for this value uh, set uh, f uh, set uh, color over lifetime um, like this for both uh, uh, and um, um, 
maybe it's better also to change size over lifetime uh, for this long one but uh, this cool like this uh, also uh, uh, I need to put uh, this glow in the front of the character because uh, because uh, I need uh, this glow uh, to close the to fully close the character. So uh, I can do this by using render alignment facing and uh, set pivot to 0 0.2 or maybe z 0 minus 0 0.2. And uh, now we have this effect, interpretation effect. Uh, also, I have this simple script just to enable and disable uh, character and uh, and uh, to enable particle system. So here is this script. Here is uh, uh, this effect. Also disable uh, looping for this effect and uh, uh, press play. You can just uh, copy this script, and uh, every time when a character appear, appears and disappears, will be this effect. Also, I think it's better to uh, change uh, the lifetime for for uh, Taurus. Maybe something like this. So you can experiment with your effects, make it really unique. Uh, and uh, this is just an example. Hope uh, this video helped you and see you in the next one.